Hi Aladdin, how are ya? How's it going? Uh oh, I'm being snooped up on. Watch this. Boom! <laughs> you can't even see it. Oh, what a pretty eye you have. I come out here to get the little horse. What do you want? Itches? Oh my gosh. Yeah, oh, itches. Everybody wants itches around here. Everybody wants itches. Don't be rude and push me around. It's not okay. We need to get you to Shelby so that he can ride you, so get you ready so I can ride you. Yeah. Yeah. Before, before you get old. Oh my. Before you get old. You're such a handsome fella. All right, I didn't come down here for you though. I didn't come down there for you either, Mr. Mr. Aladdin. He's like, he was out in the grass all day yesterday. So he's, he let me out. Not today, sir. I'm here for you, little horse. How about we go for a ride <laughs> in the horse trailer? Yeah, cause you're so cute. Wanna go for a walk with your mom? Let's go for a hike, she needs some exercise. I think you need a brushing, what the heck? How come you're itching your bum? I think y'all need showers. I'm not giving anybody showers on my day off. It's not happening. All right, let's get you, let's get you gonna load up and just hop up in the horse trailer. Huh? Okay, let's go. Hey, come on, let's go. Come on, dirty butt. Come on. Coming. Good boy. Good boy. Yes, you do. Kind of a cookie monster. I think you need a really good shower. Come on. Let's go. Ooh, up in the trailer. Come on. Come on. Here you go. Don't eat the stuff. Come on. Come on. Whoa! <laughs> good job. There you go. Okay, we're out of here. Poor guy, he's in the trailer hollering for his friends and nobody cares. <laughs> They're all eating away. Not him, he doesn't care. I got my summit in the back. Summit, say hi. Wave. <laughs> we're out. So we are here, my pony, right there. Summit is down there and um, probably about five miles from my house. And it was really cloudy and overcast and I'm like, wow, what a nice cool day to go for a walk. Yeah, get over here and the sun is just blaring. And of course I forgot my sunscreen, so I have to wear my hoodie. <laughs> Cause I don't want to spend the next, come on. Um, Oh, they're eating. Look, he's peeing and he's eating. So that's good. I don't want to spend the next five days miserable with a sunburn. So, oops, sorry, Summit. Let's go. Come on. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> so I'm going to switch this because I have another thing on here that will let me switch back and forth. And um, I think that's what I need. It'll be easier since I got two ropes and a camera in a hand. So... I'll be right back. 
There we go. Man, I have to figure out all this new technology. We already, we're having fun with ropes. It's way easier to do, deal with the dogs and stuff when they're off leash. Come here, Summit. He has his e-collar on, so we're gonna just let him walk. There's nobody out here that I can tell anyways. There's our rig, my horse. We're ready to go. Probably gonna sweat to death today. I'd like to get in the trees. Um, sorry, the camera's gonna be a little all over there. I'd like to get in the trees and out of the sunshine. So, and get some good shots. We already, come on, let's go. Summit here, good job. Um, we already heard a hawk. It's okay. He's like, what is that dog dragging? He's dragging his leash. I wanted to go down that way. Summit here. Good. We're not going to go down that way because I think it's just all open in the sun. So I guess we'll go down here for a while. This road, we've been down here a couple times already. And uh, not with the horse. This is his first walk and hike. So we've been down here walking. Come on, let's go. Summit here. Um, I ran the dogs. Hey, don't kick at my dog. I ran the uh, dogs out here on with the bikes, doing bike drawing for, and we've hiked, walked a few times out here. So, um, I, I know at the very end of this road, let's go, Summit. The very end of this is a huge fenced in area and there's a house. So these people have all of this area to drive down to their driveway or to use their driveway down to their house, which I think is quite cool. I'm kind of keeping an eye on my pony because he's not really been around the dogs a whole lot. And I don't, I don't want him to hurt anybody, obviously. Summit here, good, good, good job. Yes, good job. Scratch, scratch. Come on, let's go. I brought him water. Um, he just needs to go and uh, get used to him running around and know that my pack's not going to hurt him. So I started out with Summit because he's a good guy. Poodle could have came, but he doesn't always feel very good since he's been diagnosed with his... Um, Addison's disease so <clears throat> he's kind of like he's really aged a lot he's only six years old and he acts like he's about nine so sometimes I don't I'm just worried that he's gonna crash on me pretty hard so I'm glad I didn't bring him because it's kind of warm out here you know I don't want to put him in a situation where he's not going to do well. So, really sucks because he's pretty much uh, one of the best dogs I have as far as obedience goes. And, you know, going and doing things like I don't have to worry about him doing anything dumb. A lot of my pack, they all have issues. Their dogs somebody else didn't want. And so, come on, let's go. So... They're with me now. Uh, I'm cool with that. Summit here. Very good. Very good. Yay, Summit! He's a cool dog. He came from California. Kill shelter down in California. They have a very, very, very bad problem with dog overpopulation. Whoops. I'll step on his rope. I guess human population too, I guess. <laughs> you want to look at that away. But the shelters are full of dogs. And um, it's not very good. So the last, I didn't do anything with them last year because I was just too busy taking care of my own world. But I think in the last three or four years, I've managed to place, oh, just a handful of them. And um, so, and then I have a handful that stayed with me. So I'm full and I'm not doing it anymore. I'd rather 
train my own dogs now and focus on getting myself feeling better and doing things that I want. Summit here, the car. Come here, this, come here. This road isn't without, come on, this way. Here comes the car. Come here. This road isn't without traffic, unfortunately. Fire tracks. <sighs> That's cool. Come on. Come on, little horse. Come on. At least I know if we get into trouble, we have firemen around here to save us. Hey, get your nose out of the grass. Come on, PJ. We need to find some shade. Holy smoke. I'm going to sweat to death. Come on, Summit. Let's go. Don't kick my dog. No. He thinks, you know, he hasn't, but he's like, he looks at him like, oh, I'll kick you if you hurt me. I don't blame him because maybe he has been attacked by dogs. So, I don't know. I haven't had PJ for very long. So, um, just a couple months, I think. He's actually, I think he's actually gotten bigger since I've had him, though. So, she said he was five. But if he is, he's, he's eating while <laughs> filling out. <laughs> yeah, he looks more uh, stallion-y to me now than what he did when I first got him. So cute. Anyways. Okay. I'm going to hush. Try and get some video.
her seat. Don't drink out of my bottle. Hey, it's for me too. Gross. Drink. No, right here. Jeez. Can't have nothing myself. <laughs> Share my bottle of water with you too? My. off right now. Maybe I will. Come here. Get a good drink. Did you get enough? I think I'm going to. When we get back in the sun again, I'm going to come here. Here. Hey. Good job. Good. Here. Can you sit? Sit. Sit. Very good. You're so smart. You're a very smart dog. I must say. Hope everything will fit in there. Here. Want some more? There's grass and everything. Drink, drink. Drink, drink. <laughs> what you don't drink, you get to wear. Don't you know? <laughs> Good. <laughs> My glasses back on. I think TJ's having a good time. All right. Don't leave. Stay here. Well, we made it back to the truck and it was wonderful. Nice walk. Gotta get the air on, see if it even works. And I appreciate all you guys coming along, following along on my journey here. So we have more, more coming up in the future. So make sure you post a comment, like if you'd like, and hit a thumbs up. Make a world of difference on my YouTube channel. And um, subscribe if you wanna follow along. We got some more adventures planned and I think I have a couple grooming videos in the works in my mind. So uh, thanks everybody for following along. Have a great day. Enjoy it. Bye.